I'm vlogging again today. So lately I've needed excuses to leave the house. Usually I need excuses to stay in the house because I don't really want to leave. But as of right now, I like leaving the house, even if it's for no reason. Yesterday I ran Uber Eats with my cousin. I just sat in the car while she did her thing. Today I'm joining my friend Faye on her real estate adventures. <laughs> Why did I just say real estate adventures, what? She's gonna be touring some units and I'm gonna help her create some TikTok content and content for like socials and stuff. So I'm just gonna record her and follow her and tell her how pretty she is and let her tour the units while I just like film her. So hopefully I can show you guys the places that we're looking at because I think it's gonna be bougie. It's in Yorkville, downtown Toronto. So it's probably gonna be very nice and expensive. So I'm actually very excited to see it. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today. This is my outfit, very cozy warm you know i have a leather jacket with it but i don't think i'm gonna be wearing it also guys let me know if you like my vlogs i put a lot of work into them lately and i think it's showing i'm very happy about them but ooh, i think she's here let me know what you think and we'll talk yeah we'll talk i gotta go This view is crazy. Oh my God, look at this place. It has a cute little balcony. Love the sounds of nature. So peaceful, so quaint and serene. Then this is the main room, the main bedroom. Very humble, very cute, very humble. What am I saying? Welcome to my bedroom. I just moved here. This is my sliding door. This is my view. Yep, apartment tour, the unit. I'm rich now. I wish. This is the view from the kitchen. That is Faye, the real estate agent. Look at this kitchen, guys. Look at look at my dishwasher. It's my it's my unit. <laughs> look at my dishwasher. It's built in to the fucking thing and then the fridge i got it custom made <laughs> it's built in it's seymour which apparently it's sub zero sub -mo sub zero, <laughs> sub -zero <laughs> which apparently is state of the art and then my cabinets are really high good thing i'm tall so this kitchen actually has penthouse finishings yes exactly that's what i asked for exactly. penthouse finishing so yep <laughs> look at this Built in microwave too. <gasps> no way! Mm -hmm. They made it exactly this. how I wanted it. Yeah. Wow, this is beautiful. Fiji water because I'm rich. This is my washroom. What did you say? Built in LEDs? Uh -huh. And what was the other thing you said? Pot lights. And pot lights. High ceilings, built in LEDs. And wow. Facia. Book her if you're in the GTA. Is that how you say it? Book her? Contact her. And then this is the den. This is where Brenda's gonna be. <laughs> Dungeon. <laughs> yeah. We appreciate your honesty. <laughs> so that was my apartment tour. I hope you guys also, enjoyed it. Before you forget, there's waterfall countertops that she got. What does that mean? So that means that the countertop goes all the way down. Oh yeah, I got it custom made like this because yeah. I really love, that's really cool. Yeah. Wow, that must have been really expensive. It's an, it's an upgrade. Wow. Apartment tour moving in next week. Um, so just expect all my vlogs to have this view in it. So pretty. We're at Italy. I feel like Kelly Stamps. I've never been here. She's never been here. No. And we're exploring. And I love Italian everything. So I'm very, very excited. Ooh, I feel rich. So many food options. Yes, we'll take a tour of Italy. I literally want everything. I don't know what to do. House made bread. Oh my god. <gasps> oh. So we ended up getting cacio e pepe and we ate it and I forgot to show you guys the food, which is really sad, but it was so good. Let me show you. 
the remains. I know you can't really tell, but it was really good. Oh, from Italy, it was bomb. I really wanted tiramisu, but I didn't. Oh, I also got a coffee. Oh my God, I forgot about this. large today <laughs> but it's okay we embrace the forehead <laughs> in all its glory hi friends welcome back today i have a little vlog i'm taking myself on a date i got all cute and i'm going out i mean date is <laughs> there's nothing to do here in toronto like there's nothing open even half the parks are closed it's cold out when i say date i mean like i'm leaving the house so pretty much i'm feeling pretty sad today pretty down and i feel like i deserve a good meal not even meal dessert and i never crave dessert so this is like rare but yeah i'm about to drive quite the distance for these fluffy japanese pancakes because yes there are some closer to me but they don't do it like this place this place <laughs> The fluffy pancakes at this place are so good. They have this chocolate cream sauce. So freaking good. So that's pretty much what we're gonna do. We're gonna go get some fluffy Japanese pancakes and um, you guys are gonna join me while I take myself out for fluffy Japanese pancakes. I, I know I said I was going on a date with myself but um, Brenda came home and I realized just how sad and lonely I was today. So I asked her to come with me and like, yes, it was supposed to be a solo date, but like we have lots of days for those, okay? Today, we're not okay. So Brenda's with me. I mean, say hi, Brenda. She's shy. Nah, she went inside to go order her food. So she got some Japanese food. I got some pancakes, which is so weird for me because I literally never like sweet things. I don't know what's going on. I just wanted my souffle pancakes. So I drove for 45 minutes to go get these damn pancakes and <laughs> they're gonna be so good. But I also came for two things actually. I came for the rose milk tea latte and the pancakes and the rose milk tea latte is no longer in season. And I'm very upset. But it is what it is so we're gonna have pancakes we're gonna have a good time and then go home and that's about it welcome back <laughs> oh it's so cold hi people hi hello how are you what did you order i didn't they don't what? have bento boxes you lied to me i mean i went two years ago um they didn't have the drink that i wanted i'm really sad Okay guys, this is the meal. Um, it's tiny now, like it's actually so tiny. Even the soft serve ice cream serving is like three bites worth and this was $15. It's really good, but it's just like really overpriced. Everything since COVID has just like gone up in price and like down in size and it's actually like such a rip off, but I, yeah. So these are the fluffy Japanese pancakes. So Brenda just took 45 minutes to decide <laughs> on food. <laughs> Literally, it's dark now. How long was that? An hour? 45? It looks good. Oh, that looks good. Uh, bro, that cost the same amount as that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? There's no forks. So go get some. <laughs> that looks good. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm so mad that I wasted my money on that stupid pancake. I'm never buying that pancake again. Okay, this one's dirty. This one's clean. 